Oh, All right. Lord of so do small Not jobs until the big jobs, jobs roll in. The ones with a more personal touch. If breaking some more your thing, go talk to Vex. Um, tell me about the Sometimes bedlam job. We just like to remind the city that we mean business, so we hit them hard. Just steal whatever we can until we made an impression. Simple, right? A good thing that I Almost. make an impression every the time. Catch is, it doesn't count if anyone sees you take it. The message needs to be clear. We work in the shadows. Steal from anywhere in the hold. And you even get to keep everything you stole. So, you in? Take it. Keep this up, and you'll be rich enough to retire before you know it. Good luck. Thanks, Delvin. Okay. Get back in here. Pretty sure that I'm the Thieves Guild Master. I always go in the wrong door. Always in the wrong doors. I'm just gonna double back through here. And boop a doop a doop. Um, but I look the eye of the whatever guy, I can't remember what he's called. Ah. Wanted to say something to you. That's nice. I don't have anything to say to you, though. I want to talk to you now. I think you're all right. In fact, I'm kind of impressed how well you're doing around here. Just keep it between us, okay? I'm sure we'll speak again. All right. Sure, we'll. Yeah. Weirdo. Look, if I was a little harsh before, I just want you to know it's because you were new. You know what I mean? Do you want Look, to tell me your real name? I don't really know you. I don't even really know anyone here. I'm Why the guild master. Shut it's up. Not like we're family. This is a business. Nothing had to make you this angry. Me? All right, I'll tell you. I'll tell you about the time I was a young girl, barely out of her teens, living on a pig farm in the middle of nowhere. Didn't have a coin to spend between our entire family. Ate the same slop we fed our livestock. Sounds horrible. Oh wait, it gets much better. How about the fact that our farm was attacked by bandits, and that they killed my entire family who didn't even brandish a weapon against them? Here's the best part. They took me as a prize and violated me for a fortnight. Tossed me from bandit to bandit like, like... You don't have to continue that. It's fine. Just, just let that go. I had to tell someone, I suppose. Carrying around a weight like that, it hurts after a while. Cuts you inside like a dagger to the heart. How did you escape? Over time, I managed to gain their confidence. Then one night, I grabbed a knife, waited until they fell asleep, and cut their throats. I never returned to that pig farm, you know. There's nothing for me there. So that's my sad story. What do you think? You'll never tell me your real name. Day. Just not today. Okay. I hope we bump into each other again. Yeah, no problem. We're besties now, you and me. You told me your story. That makes us best friends. Come here a second. Uh, how did you I end up in the guild? In Valenwood, working at my father's winery. We made the finest wine to ever cross your lips, I promise you. We were doing well. Plenty of coin, a huge mansion, and I was even betrothed to a lovely young woman. Why did you leave it all behind then? Because it was dull. Every day was the same boring routine. Working at the winery, social visits with friends, parties with no one I cared about. Ah. I just wanted a little excitement. Something dangerous. Like being a thief. I hooked up with a guild in Valenwood. I think they called themselves the Silver Crescents. Spent quite a few years doing jobs for them. Made a lot of coin, but I didn't care. I didn't really need it. I was running with them because it fit. Made me feel alive. Well then, how did you end up in Skyrim, buddy? Well, after a while, my a long move. To what I was doing. He confronted me one night and gave me a choice. Either leave Valenwood, or he'd have me thrown into jail. Gave me a day to say my goodbyes to everyone. What a dick. I ended up in Skyrim thanks to a contact I'd made when I was with the Crescents. Good old Delvin. He introduced me to Gallus, and that was it. I've been here ever since. 
Now you're just you working. What? Despite what I left behind, I don't regret it one bit. Well, that's good. I used to live in Valen. We were doing well. Plenty I, uh, of coin, a huge mansion. I'm gonna go now. I uh, accidentally pushed the wrong button. The Nocturna statue. Sapphire. Something I can help with. Hey, good to see you. Be seeing you. Rune. Guy, uh, uh, who are you? You're making Dipper waves the fleet. around here. I like that. How'd you earn your name? On a job a few years back. It was supposed to be a simple burglary on a house in Windhelm. I was working with Vex, and we got inside with no trouble. We found the loot and made our way out. Sounds to be normal and uneventful, so how did the fleet come in? Well, it was. Up until the point where we set foot outside. The house was surrounded by town guard. The client had ratted us out. Vex just tells me to run. So I did. Half of them went after me. The other half went after her. Neither one of you got caught because you're both here. Are you kidding me? Vex lost them in seconds. Once she steps into the shadows, she vanishes. Me? I ran. And I ran. Straight through the gates of Windhelm. And all the way back to Riften. Okay, Force Gump. Vex was waiting for me at the flagon when I came in. Drenched in sweat. Everyone just took a look at me and laughed. You had a horse, didn't you? Well, I had forgotten we had our horses tied up just outside of Windhelm. Vex rode hers back and arrived hours before I did. So, that's how I earned the name. Now keep it to yourself. Okay. Fine. It was on a job a few years Damn back. Damn it! It was supposed My to be a simple in burglary on a what house in Windhelm. I, uh, I need... Not you. that. What's in here? Oh yeah, this is the uh, the very, very empty treasure room. I'm gonna I'm gonna go now, everybody. Everybody's doing well here, so we're going. No door, stop! Stop closing on me. Let me out of this freaking hole. Okay. Let's see. What do I need here? The bedlam job. Steal 500 gold and white run. Retrieve the copper and ruby circlet from Radiant Raymond's in solitude. Okay. Lights out. Put the fire out in the solitude lighthouse. Travel with Barabbas to the, cr to the shrine of Clav Clavius Vile. You know what? We're going to go to Whiterun. No, I need that to close. Whiterun. Actually, you know what? Because we're going to do the bedlam job too while we're there. What? Run! Really, I need a lot of, or a couple things here. Yeah, cold won't be good for my crops. Never is. Whoa, whoa! I need you to back it, back it up, home slice. My super minimalistic bare house. What do I got for books? Uh. Or all the books. All right, now let's check the books. Um, take one of those. Anything? I got two. Uh, we got a few things we've got two of. Oh, we have a lot of dudes here. Okay, anything? Uh, of course, the last book, too. Nope, I need to uh, quit the alchemy table. I need to look at the pouch that's on the alchemy table. I need to put everything except the... Uh,
Let's accept those in. Everything in the pouch. Everything goes in the pouch. Do 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 do. Okay. Where's that? We also need to go to the castle. Um, any, you know what, this barrel right here, this barrel. Looks like the barrel I want to put all these books in. There we go. Aha! Now cleaned out a fair majority of what we, uh... My favorite drinking buddy. Let's get some mead. I don't want to get some mead with you right now. I'm currently on business, running through the, splashing through the puddles. Purple flowers. All right, let's talk to uh, what's her face, the Gray Main family. To our home. Mother, what's the meaning of this? Who have you brought into our home? Avrostein, put that down. She's here to help us find Thorold. How do we know she's not spying for the Battleborn? This was foolish. We can't trust anyone. Who knows what they'll do if they find me here? I can't take any more of this. No weapons, please. Don't take this Let's the just wrong talk. way. But you look a little All sickly. Right, so, you're here to help? Absolutely, what can I do? I know that Thorald's not dead. I just know it. The Imperials have him and are keeping him somewhere. But I don't know. Why would they do that? What could they possibly they gain from this? Borns. They know something. They're hiding it. They practically taunt us with it. They must have some sort of proof. There's got to be something in that house of theirs. I just know it. Okay. I don't dare leave the house myself. So I need your help. Um, what sort of proof Anything do you need? Anything that confirms that Thorald isn't dead, but is being held captive. I know those Battleborns have it. They'd be hiding it, of course. Wouldn't want it to get out that they've been lying this whole time. But you might be able to butter them up enough to lower their guard. Okay. Why do you think the Battleborns the are involved? Battleborns, the Emperor's biggest bootlickers here in Whiterun. Their connections to the Empire and the Legion are well known. When Thorald didn't return home, there was no question in my mind. They knew Thorald supported the Stormcloaks, knew he was gonna aid them in battle, made sure he didn't come back. Locked him up someplace to get back at my family. I'm sure of it. Okay. Best if you didn't mention to anyone that you saw me here. Fair. Do I? Have an active uh, reduced weapon skill. Rock joint. You're right, I look sickly. You know what I'm gonna do? Go pray at the Shrine of Talos over here. Cause that's gonna get rid of it. Your children, your very Look, rock joint's gone. Nothing. The Empire does nothing. Wait. Yeah, I need to go here. Nope, don't want to break in. Not right in front of the guard like that. I could have been a bad situation. So I guess we'll go up to the castle. And, uh... See if we can break down any of the items that we are currently carrying, and if not, then we'll just, uh, I'll just take them someplace and sell them here in a hot minute. I, mm, nope. I need to use this, thanks! Adept robes of illusion, necklace of health. 